Hello, Kathleen. You're here with Bella Katrina. Thank you for your soulmate snapshot. We have a lot of messages for you, darling. All the angels are here and um, your eternal father is here with a message for you. Hebrews 4.12, the word of God is living and active, sharper than any double-edged sword. It penetrates even to dividing soul and spirit, joints and marrow. It judges the thoughts and attitudes of the heart. Matthew 8.16, in Jesus' name, demons will be driven out with a word and all the sick will be healed. There's also this one. Declare God's word, proclaim it, pronounce it, and use it in prayer. So God's saying to use his word um, often because you're a healer. You heal the sick of mind and spirit and body. So well done, Kathleen. Welcome from OR. I don't know what that is, but I'm Bella Katrina from Sydney, Australia, and we are touching your heart in the US of A have all the angels here for you regarding your soulmate love so thank you for your purchase we're tuning into your energy field now now Raphael came in um, Archangel Raphael the healing angel for you and has a message about talking to your body listening to your body because you take on pain of others and it shows up as arthritis or pain in your shoulders neck and back so to help alleviate this, this is a message for you because um, you're a ray of sunshine to a lot of people. But you are needing to get this vitamin D that comes from um, the sun. It's absorbed through the crown chakra and the retina of your eye. Therefore, no hat or sunglasses is needed. And that's a natural way to um, lift your dopamine levels. So you need vitamin D for your bones as well, I get, and you need it to get one with a horsetail herb, which is going to take, also you need calcium. So calcium, horsetail herb and vitamin D, because the horsetail herb is the carrying mechanism, takes it from the gut to the bone. So it's the carrier. Also eating fruit that has been ripened in the sun. And also I get that you're going to a sunny spot. And I get that your soulmate looks something like this. So needing to de to hydrate as well because you're very dehydrated. So dear Archangel Raphael, thank you for motivating and guiding me to drink more water. If you just say it out loud, it works better. So that my health, energy and appetite stay at optimal levels throughout the day. So getting two litre thing of water, purified water, so it's decalcified, no fluoride. Dear Archangel Raphael, please help me enjoy the benefits of sunshine in safe and healthy ways. Because light is information and you're not getting outdoors enough. Light is information, remember that. And it's information for your body to self-heal because you are needing some... Um, divine light from your creator and he's here for you isn't that good so we're looking at soulmate coming up for you kathleen from or which could be what did they say it was <laughs> i don't know <laughs> oregon it's not orlando is it because that's be florida i've been there i've been to orlando been to a few places in the States, so I'm very excited to connect with you. Your growth in your spiritual growth, so this is going for through your ascension and also you're very, becoming very mature in your thoughts, how you're looking back on the past, right, and letting go of re any resentments and learning to accept yourself and just accept that everything's going in the right direction for me. Beautiful. You've done a lot of work. And here's your healing coming in today. I've already set up your healing for you. Coming through the crystal amethyst. So I've got two amethysts here and also Jesus, sacred heart. Mother Mary's also here for you. So we are going to get a quick message from her. And this is regarding just your love life here. 
your soulmate connection. So what happens is you're learning or studying something new so that you can work, move into a new field of making money. And that comes in as abundance, right, and an answered prayer. However, there's a little bit of work to do. And the reason that, um, so this, this looks like studying self-healing, you know, and receiving. So this would be studying Reiki with me. That's me. <laughs> teaching you Reggie. So you can learn to self-heal because you've already got the other bit down. You can already heal others just by being around them. They feel better. So you're learning that, yes, you're a powerful healer. Your prayer has been answered here, but you need some focus. That's why you're needing to be grounded because you're going to turn this abundance the right way up. Sometimes your prayer doesn't look exactly like what you think it's going to look like. So it like it's like you need needing to get really balanced in your focus on what's going to work for you in your life purpose really right because you seem to be all over the place just needing some direction and then you're you balance your energies that's what the angels are saying before your lover comes in your lover so let's have a look archangel michael's got a message for you too for kathleen So you're needing to get more sleep, okay, because it's like you're not remembering your dreams, not working things out in your dreams because you're not going into that deep, um, you know, theta state. And here is innocence where you've been blaming yourself in the past. So needing to get more sleep, sunshine and water. It's just basics. Learning self-care with Reiki with me. Either get your soulmate Reiki and see if you like it. Then you can go on to Reiki level 1, 2 and 3. Or just go straight into level 1. If you're interested, I can send you an introduction to Reiki by Bella workshop. So in your dream state is where you create your romance. That's why you need to be there. Because there's a few, they're showing me right now that there's a few people around you. There are a few offers and you're confused. So let's have a look what's coming up in romance for Kathleen. You may be with somebody and thinking about somebody else. So let's have a look. Romance angels, come to us now. Surround Kathleen with a million of you, as many that will fit into her home. And just surround her with healing light now. So, this is not um, right in front of you. It's in the ether and it's coming in as a manifestation. So please draw it in through, um, you know, your visualizations and affirmations. There is a person here that God's ordered just for you. And it's very, very exciting. It's like an elixir of love. And all your fears just go straight out the window because you are a different person now. You're free. This is in the past. You've done the work. Something that you cut yourself free on. It's false beliefs. And your energy has lifted up. Okay, so it's worth waiting for, even though you keep feeling disappointed because it's just not clicking into place as fast as you'd like. This is helping you, though, take it in your pace and open your heart as you, you know, feel comfortable. And then it's time to receive. Again, this is a big call to receive because your heart can give, but it's not easy to receive here. So looking down here, somebody's caught your attention. There's been an exchange of energy. And um, underneath is one of your married or both of you are married to somebody else, maybe. So that's all you have been and that person's still in your energy field. You know you can be with somebody and not have seen them, been married to them and not have seen them for eight years and they're still in your energetic field. You know, you do carry that energy. That's why it'd be good for you to learn Reiki to clear your aura. So it will take out the pain. It's like you're carrying somebody else's burdens with you, right? So here is what you've been aiming to free yourself from. However, there's an echo of it comes back underneath. Guilt, something around guilt. But that is clearing the more you bring in the energy, the high energy of flirting, and the more you trust and open to everybody, then your divine partner just steps forward. 
very obviously. But here you're having to practice a little bit. So there might be a few stepping stones along the way. You know, like having to practice speaking up on your own behalf and on your heart and talking about your feelings, just easily expressing your feelings and flirting. I feel like there's a few stepping stones here, opening your heart and then you go, wow, it was worth waiting for. And I had fun practicing in the meantime. So here we are, this situation is calling for you to have faith. It's really a test of faith, isn't it? <laughs> Love. But your heart's ready and sometimes, you know, there is, um, they're just showing me here, you think, just as this person arrives, brings up just the last of where you were and, you know, it's like you start the relationship where, from where you left the last one from that intimacy level. So straight away you go into an intimacy level that you've had in the past and it will stretch you. You know what I mean? So it's like, it's your test of, are you really free? And you are free, but then you'll know you're free and that feels exhilarating. So just, you know, know that um, this is all set up for your strength and your power. Just show trust. You pulled this card because true and lasting love is here for you. If your question was about a specific person, then this card serves as validation of the relationship's divine nature. This individual has genuine love for you and you both can overcome the issues that arise. This is especially the case if you can express your feelings through atti attitudes or attributes such as kindness, compassion and courtesy toward each other. For instance, having honest conversations. Would be an expression of your true love, even if it involves discussing uncomfortable topics like... <laughs> leaving another partner. If you're currently seeking a relationship, this card offers you assurance that true love is on its way. Keep the faith that a wonderful relationship is destined to come to you and don't compromise with an unsuitable partner. It's essential that you treat yourself well by taking excellent care of yourself for the foundation of a true love relationship is two people who cherish each other. So cherishing yourself and knowing that um, leaving all guilt behind from the past and really being free. Once you've passed this test, you get this influx of um, high energy love vibration. So you would love soulmate Reiki because that is actually an activation that raises your vibration and people open to love that haven't had love for years. Within 90 days, really it's a month. So let's have a look what Mother Mary is advice for you because she says you talk to her often. Is that correct? You need to comment below and let me know how this resonates with you. And um, then we're going to look at, oh, prayer. Instead of worrying, I pray about this situation of, to bring about real solutions. Again, talking to the Father. And again, truth. I am lovingly honest with myself and others. So practicing being honest about how you're feeling just every day with those people around you and start sentences with I feel. And then you explain I feel this and I either like this or I don't like this. And then you can make a request, right? So it's like I feel upset when you talk like that. So I don't like this feeling. So I'm requesting that we talk about something else. Would that be okay? You know? And then pray about anything that you're worrying about instead of worrying about it because you actually create energy and send that vibration out. And then we get that back and we get really upset. So let's have a look here for Jesus, a message for Kathleen. It's showing me you read the Bible, you read God's word, needing maybe to start spiritual um you know, getting your spiritual gifts, get your baptism. Also showing me that um, you need the armor of God because you're one of his selected children, he's saying. Thou shalt love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind. What's that one? I am the good shepherd. The good shepherd giveth his life for his sheep. Thank you, Jesus, for giving your life for us. We're his sheep. So he's saying he already gave his life for you. That's why you have the gift and ability to heal, miraculous healings. And if you pray over people, you've had past lives where you've been very, very close with Mother Mary. I wouldn't even um, be surprised if it was in a nunnery. We'll find out in your shabam. Because um, 
God doesn't come in for just everybody. <laughs> you got to go through the angels first and then you got to get God. So he came straight in and he's saying you, you are like that. You will give your life for souls. You have a love for human souls just like God does. But personalities get in the way, you know. Archangel Michael, what's coming up for soulmate snapshot? Here, romance for Kathleen. This situation is already resolved. So there's something in the way here. I get there's something in your aura that you need to clear out and pray about to allow new love in. Dear Archangel Michael and Jesus, dear Father God, I give any worries, cares and concerns to you in exchange for true peace in all ways. Thank you for resolving this, bringing in the, my romance of a lifetime, the lover who's mine by divine right, in a divinely perfect way. Thank you, thank you. It's already resolved. It's already picked out for you. You've already freed yourself. However, there's a test coming back or there's something that um, is in your auric field still. Somebody may be draining you because there's energy healing work needed. Thank you for sending healing energy to me and through me, for my own blessings and for all those around me. Thank you for connecting me to loving and high integrity healers and teachers of energy healing modalities. So that would be with me. I teach that Reiki energy healing. That's what I was saying to you. So Archangel Michael's backing that because you need to be really bright. And sometimes we're under attack because... We don't realize how bright we are, but the dark side does. So let's have a look here at your um, your soulmate coming towards you. In the month of June, how is your soulmate coming towards you once you've filled up with this awesome, light, flirtatious, heart-filled energy? Show me, show me. Hope you're enjoying your snapshot. There's... Um, the reason why you're allowed in because it had actually finished Kathleen. So you just snuck in there, didn't you? So here's the Ace of Swords coming down as the truth. You can see the truth. You are, are awakening. Your codes are awakening, right? And you're feeling like on fire. This is very frisky, very frisky energy. Need a lover. Ready for a new, fresh start, even with the same person. But however, you've seen the truth. So that's why it's the test because otherwise you can get in the cycle and do another two years with this person and it's not going to happen because your codes are awakening, you're awakening. So that's what happens is you realise that it's like this suit doesn't fit me anymore. You know, this shows me that you've changed on the inside so much that the outside hasn't changed yet but it's about to. It's like when I worked for the Depression and Dementia Conference Centre in Sydney. I'd wear a black suit. And then I went off to Hawaii to Dorian Virtue's um, Angel Therapy Practitioner Workshop. And oh my gosh, I flew back in and had to put the black suit on and go to the Dem Dementia and Depression Conference at the Sydney Entertainment Centre. i never forget it. And I was sitting there going, oh my gosh, that was a tower moment. It's like, I am going to burn this suit and I'm never doing this work again. <laughs> Also, you know, it's just like realising that this is all, it was all set up for people to have, they were all justifying their jobs and they, it was all governmentally granted and it's all for nothing. They weren't looking for a real, you know, cure. It was just weird. That was a massive tower moment and that was my life purpose, what I stood for, what my future was. It was just massive. So that's what they're saying here for you. Right, There's something that you're just bursting forth. Here's the fool coming out with fire, with passion, with the truth. So you have to make a decision here, right? Because this looks like once the truth, the tower comes down and you can't stay there anymore. That's what the tower's about. It's like you just can't fit in that suit anymore. So you have to get a new one and look at you go. So there's something really amazing coming up that you're going to be pushed, propelled forward into and then you're going to realise that this is the external but I've changed internally and then the external will change in front of your face automatically which means that you're making a choice for a lover to come in. There is a choice here for you to receive a lover but there's a lot of, um, it's, ju it's just under here you feel like it's the one from the past and it may be somebody new. 
But anyway, you have to f- still figure out how to end that cycle, you know. But it looks like it's the ending of a cycle and the beginning of a new one at exactly the same time. God's saying just help um, yourself by praying to him using his word and learning about your spiritual gifts. And love will be in front of you when you, it will appear externally on the outside. You don't have to worry about a thing. There is a divine love partner here for you and you're going to step forward into something quite magical, right? It's going to blow your mind. So I hope you've enjoyed this reading. I hope you can connect with me soon with your Shabam and um, just be calm and peaceful because it's like your whole love story will manifest right before your eyes. The calmer and the more grounded you are, allowing it in and receiving love from the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit and Mother Mary and Reiki by Bella.com. <laughs> Thank you for joining me. I hope you've enjoyed this. May God bless you in magical, wonderful ways. And um, I hope to connect with you again soon on your free upgrade in your Shabam with me or your soulmate Reiki, which is an activation and a workshop. And then we get a reading and some therapy. And hopefully... I'll connect with you there. I love you. Thanks for watching. You've been with Bella Katrina from ReikiByBella.com. Bye for now.